Hi everyone, today I'm going to show you the basics of Toggle. How you're going to use Toggle to track your time. So first here on Google, you just search Toggle. And then this is the one, you click this one. This is what we're going to use, the Toggle Time Tracker. You click um, sign up. It is for free, so you don't need to pay anything. You need to sign up for free. And then click the I agree to terms of service and privacy policy. And choose here where you want to sign up using your Google or via Apple or sign up via email. It's up to you where you want to sign up here on Toggle. Let's say that you are already um, have an account for Toggle. Now let's log in. I'm here now on the dashboard of Toggle Track. Now what you're, go you're going to use is this one, the timer. Once you are logged in, you will be directed to the timer dashboard. So here is the timer dashboard. Now this is the, what you're going to use. In here, on what are you working on, this is the title of the task or what type of task that you're going to do. So let's just say test then toggle basics. So this is the title for, this is the example title for this task. So I'm going to click the play button to start my time, okay? Once you click the play button, you will see it here. This is how you will monitor your work hours. And then, for example, you need to pause your time. You need to take a break. Just click the stop button. And then the time, that you, the time entry that you um, entered when you're doing your task will be recorded here. It will appear here below. When you are ready to um, resume again your task, just click the play button here and press play. And then your timer will resume again. Okay, as you can see, once you resume your time, you click this one, the play button again, you will see there will be a number two here. This is this this means that you have two time entries for today. When you click this one, you will see the time when you started working and then you pause and then when you resume again, you will see the time here, the time entry here again. Okay. All your time entries will be recorded here below. This is going to be sorted by the date this is the first time entry that this account have. So it is um, labeled as today. So as under the today, you will see a number two. It means that you have two time entries for today. So when you click that one, you will see all your time entries here. And then on the right side here, this is the total um, number of hours based on your time entries here. And then on this side, on the left side here, on the this week, this is your total hours that you work for the week. The, sec the second thing that you need to know is that you need to learn sending the reports, how to have a report of your work hours that you need to send. Okay, on the left side, under the analyze, you will see a report. You will click this one. And then you will see here the work, work hours that you 
accumulated for the specific days. We have the summary, the detailed, and the weekly. So for the summary, this is the overall from Monday to Friday. Um, you will see here how many hours, per, uh, example, on Monday, how many hours you accumulated. You will see it here at the top. And then on this side, the duration and the percentage of the total hours of your work for the week. And then on the right side, you will see the clock in hours um, you have for the week. And then for the detailed, this is the specific time entries. You will see it here, the specific time entries that you have for the entire week. Okay, and then for the weekly, you will see it here how many hours you accumulated for the week, the total hours per week. So what we need for you to download is the summary, this one. You just click this um, download sign and download as a PDF. And then the other one is the weekly. Same thing, just click the download um, icon and then click the download as PDF. Okay, once you download those, uh, send it through email. Okay, now I'm going to show you the file that we downloaded earlier. This is the report that we downloaded earlier. So this is for the weekly report. This is how it looks like. And then for the summary report, you will see here the time entry, what title of the task, the title of the tasks that you've done for the week and the user time entry as well. This is you. You will see your profile picture here and your name here. And the type of the tasks that you did for the week. So those are the two things that you need to know. How to track your time, your working hour, your working time, and then how to send a report for your work hours for the week. If you have any questions, just please message me on WhatsApp and I will be happy to help you. Thank you and have a great day.